hello, hello, Virgo, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today, we are going to be pulling messages for the week of March the 28th until April the 3rd. Where has the time gone? I can't do four of these. These are long. I need... I'm going to do one of these and a one love message, and then we're going to do a reading. Please, universal energies, just one. One for Virgo. Here we go. Guidance and release the past to the eternal wings and allow new energies to enter your life. You are a creation that is vast and endless with no beginning and no end. Allow your life to flow like a river. The, the spirit of life will guide you and keep you safe. Okay. Uh, pulling out a love message. Please, universal energies. One love message. I can only do one. Um, I waited. Waited. Don't rush into it. Allow nature to take its course. Wait. Wait, okay? Don't run into things that you don't know what they're about. Okay? And here we go. This is the image. Wait. Take your time. Take your time in moving forward. Sometimes we need to breathe. Sometimes we need to think before we do things, you know? All right, so here we go. First one out. Oh, we actually got two. King of Wands. Okay, some of you <clears throat> may be enjoying your life. I feel that you are. Some of you may be hot and sexy and really not looking for a commitment right now, whether you are male or female, doesn't fucking matter. King of Wands is somebody that, you know, they're dependable. They can be a lot of fun. This is the type of person that you, um, you know, I'm going to be honest, you can have a lot of hot, passionate sex with, you know, they're hot, they're passionate, they're fucking hot, they're cute, you know, they're good looking, beautiful, sexy. Okay. And like I said, could be a woman. Um, strength okay so some of you i feel like some of you have worked on yourself i feel like in the past it was work that you put into yourself i feel that it did take some you know something out of you like it like you had to be strong through a lot of things and here we go um making a true offer i don't know i think somebody somebody if somebody's been trying to catch you and hold you down and you're not being held down because you're like i'm gonna stand strong and tell you that i am just a little single you know and and i'm that's what i'm picking up you know and i think that this person is not gonna fucking be happy for you they want to trap you virgo okay king of wands why is it here King of Wands, I feel like some of you are out to have a good time. And listen, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Um, you know, as long as you do it responsibly. Ace of Cups. Ooh. Some of you are looking for love. Somebody here may be looking for love. You know, I don't know. I just feel like you're trying to get away from this person. But let's see. Um, Ace of Cups. Maybe that's why you have the weight here because somebody is telling you that you need to hold it. Don't rush it. Don't rush into it. Um, Ten of Cups and the Hermit. Okay, so there's some healing that has to be done before you can find your happiness. Ten of Cups and Hermit energy showing up for you. So I feel that, you know, I feel like you, if you are single, I feel like you want to give your all. I feel like for those of you that are doing the work and standing strong and making some solid ground for yourself, I feel that um, you know that this is something that you need to do. Therefore, you're not going to rush into a commitment with somebody. Somebody may be trying to rush you into a commitment and for some of you, you're not going to be ready. So take your time. You know, if the person really loves you, if you're a male or a female, a male or female, if the person really loves you, they will wait. You know, if the person really respects your desires, you know, there will be a conversation about this, you know. 
but I just feel like, you know, I feel like some of you want to take your time. So really do not rush into this decision, whatever decision some of you are having to make. Okay. Um, why is the strength here? Strength four. Okay. Too many. Mm -mm. Can't do eight. <laughs> Can't do eight, Virgo. Okay. There we go. I can do two. Okay. Knight of Wands and the Two of Cups. See, I feel like you were giving very little because I don't think that this is somebody that maybe, I don't know. I feel like you were taking your time with the Knight of Wands and the Two of Cups in the past. I feel like there was somebody here that perhaps, I feel like you are, if you are looking, oh my God, I'm getting so tongue tied. If you are looking for new love, you you need to take your time. Okay. Because some of you may rush into something that you see as a brand new love and you know it may turn out to be something else you know and i'm going to tell you in the future there's somebody here who's going to lose patience you know this is somebody losing patience as you can see this person is coming in with a sword angry expressing a message you know and let me tell you like i said if somebody does not want to wait for you to take your time and decide what's right for you, then they really don't have their best interest in you, you know? Um, why is the Knight of Swords here? Knight of Swords, why is it here? For Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please, Universal Energy, Spirit Guides, Ancestors, why is the Knight of Swords here in the outcome for Virgo? Okay, I still got five, you know, I guess it's better than eight, but in this particular, um, okay, so let's see what we have here. I'm going to take all, all of them. Knave of swords. <laughs> see, I can't make this up. Not once, but twice. Okay, so I feel like somebody's going to be angry. They're going to be mad. You know, this is an argument. Five of Wands, it's almost like fucking drama, like having to deal with fucking drama. I'm going to tell you, some of you may have gotten involved with somebody that was not available to you. You were not available to them. They could have been stuck with somebody else. They could have had in love with somebody else already. They could have even been married to somebody else. You know, Three of Cups, there's somebody here that's looking to... um to patch things up, you know, this could be, you know, but this was probably over a third party energy. Like I said, with the three of cups and the five of wands, I feel that with the nine of cups, you know, this is certainly not where you're going to find your happiness. You know, there was somebody here breadcrumbing somebody else, you know, and therefore the 10 of swords, for those of you, um, I'm going to tell you, there's somebody here that's going to feel backstabbed and betrayed, you know, um, I feel that if they or you have been um, in a third party energy um, as a third party with a third party, part of the fucking third party, because there's a breadcrumbing situation here, I feel that this is coming to an end. OK, whatever third party is, it's coming to the end. All right. I really, um, you know, if some for some of you, if you are, like I said, if you're fucking around with married people, that's how I'm picking it up. When you step away from this, this person is going to be fucking angry. All right. So listen, I hope that this was able to help some of you. Thank you so much, Virgo, for being here and take care.